I think we are ready to go. I realize the music's not playing because it just cuts out for whatever reason. They didn't really think that through, did they? Let me see. Oh, we're fine. All right. Everything seems good to go. You know what I haven't really done in a while? Let me show the what achievements we got. All right. So let's see. Uh, I think we've only uh, we completed chapter sixteen. We did that. Uh, what else did we get? We got. I think I already showed this off, but we got Lorenz. We got equip mark with Mercurius. We got the Grat uh, Gradivus from Camus. Uh, and we got. We did manage to get the Starlight spell, even if it was brief. Uh, we did promote Sheeta for a second, so that worked out. Okay. And we already did that. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that worked out. All right. Let's get back to chapter 17. So, last time I did okay. I was actually going to win, but then Tiki got attacked by two reinforcements. So last time, I had Lena warp Kane, and he went to deal with the thief. Speed, luck, and weapon level. Alright. Now to start sending people over. I didn't really use Navar or Abel last time, but it is not a bad idea to bring them anyway. Merrick being over here was actually really useful. to go this way. Minerva I sent to the left. Uh, Garst also went to the left. Agma also goes here. Sheeta I had over here. Julian's just gonna have to hang out here for a little while. I have Lind going this way. Zane is hanging out over here for now. Castor. I... Mm, I had him go to the left and he helped. He did help. I think I'm gonna have him go this way again. However, if this fit... The reason why I won last time... Or not one, quote unquote, but did well. Was I had Tiki attack Micaeus, and she got a crit. 
and that's how I was able to just do well. So I'm thinking if that, if we have trouble getting rid of him, I'm thinking next time we send, we send Abel over here, and maybe even Navarre, and then we bring Castor this way. I think that sounds like a plan to me. Some dragoons to that side. Okay. It is kind of interesting that this is a case where the boss actually leaves his fort to actually attack. That does change things about this chapter. But it basically means that, like, in a turn or two, I could just, like, send someone here, like, Marth, and just warp him over <laughs> with the Worm Slayer. Like, it's that simple. Okay, spend some time healing. You've lured out, uh, you've lured them out enough. Zane could actually be used. Hold on. I mean, he just has a sword currently. But we can actually use him. Hold on. Because he copies the stats. Granted, he'll have the iron weapon, but... It's something. He's not that strong, but hey, it's, uh, he can maybe do something. Maybe. And I want Leno over here. Okay. It'll be very important to get close. Get close enough. Last time, uh, Navarre and Abel didn't really get to do anything. Part of it is that the, the flyers seem to just hang out. Hang out on this section, so, like, Mark couldn't get close. Got it? All right. Because of that, Navarra and Abel weren't really able to do anything. And most of the ones that came over here are flyers. And because they hung out on the rock, on, on the cliff side, they didn't, you know. That's why I'm thinking, if I fail again, I'll bring... Send Navarra and Abel to the left. And Castor goes to the right. Kind of what I'm thinking. Okay. So Kane barely got any healing in. Okay, so this is a little bit different. Okay, so here's here's something. I can have like Marth get attacked by both these guys. And I 
think we'll be okay. Assuming he's in range. He is not. He is not in range, but we could take advantage of this. Hold on. We could take advantage of this. Let's swap the iron with the worm slayer. Let's go to the supply. I'm going to store the iron. I'm going to take the other worm slayer. Okay. Just one square up from the forest? Yes. Navar, you stand here, you equip the Worm Slayer. We're talking 10 movements. I want, I wanted Tiki in this corner. That's where she was last time. And I think you go here. Yeah, that'll work out okay. Get Lena closer. Merrick, you can stand here. Uh, Julian needs to wait, because I don't want to get too close. Over here, you have an attack of 20, you have a defense of 8. It's 12. It's not bad. He could survive a hit, but he can't survive two. Okay. Um, yeah, we had this problem last time. I'm putting Castor here. Can Minerva get the kill? No. Well, I already know Kane can take a single hit. So I want him, like, down here. For the steel. Alright. Magma, you can go up here. And Lind, you'll follow. You're following. Able, you stay there, I guess. Minerva. I guess we'll just have Minerva stay here. Alright. Yes, Navar. I, I called him Agma for a second. That wasn't even a. That wasn't even a crit. That's just base damage. Go, Navar. Get rid of these dragoons. This is the power of a promoted unit. Get out of here. I would have loved to hand the KO to Mark, but he, he was too far. Strength, luck, weapon level, HP. And we got the dragon whip. Alright. We got the flyers heading the way. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I want Castor to take down one of those for sure. The flyers aren't as bad as you think. They just have javelins and they have terrible accuracy, but they can gain up on him. And the calves are slowly on their way. They'll get there, eventually. Okay, on this side, Tiki goes first. We attack. Last time she got a crit. Come on. 
come on. Yep, I know. Well, I got unlucky. But I, I honestly shouldn't expect to crit every time. Anyway. Merrick. With your Excalibur. Let's go. Oh, the shield protects him. But I got the crit. I lucked out. I lucked out. Skill, luck, weapon level, HP. And we got Iot's shield. Um, yeah, it seems Iot's shield just protects the flyer from any weakness, not just arrows. So, that could have been a lot worse. Uh, Marth, can we actually get. No, we can't get it. Can we get Arcane? Or can we get Mabel? Mabel, let's actually hand you this one. There we go, we got crit. Okay. Navar, you can just head up. And we'll make sure to equip probably the steel for now. Uh. Lena, I'll let you go ahead and get rid of one. Last time they were targeting Sheeta. And while she could deal with them, if she gets hit too many times, it's just... We're just trying to avoid her getting ganged up on. Probably the silver. Ten? Oh, wow. Well, hmm. No matter what, she won't get the KO unless she crits. Let's try it. Let's try giving her the crit. Not enough. Marth, you head up here. Uh, equip. Oh, probably the steel. I don't think you need the Mercurius Sword equipped at the moment. Over here. Castor, go ahead and grab that kill. Perfect. Level 4, Strength and Skill. Uh, let's see if Lind can grab it with Shaver. We got a crit. Alright. It's going well. Can I get someone on the fort? No. Agma and Bars can hang out here. Uh, I want Minerva to move one square down. Is that right? One square down? Yes. Kane's still weakened. And Zane's just here. Julian can actually start moving. Oh no, that one got healed. And now it's at full health. Yeah, I want to get Sheeta to level 10 and promote her. She really needs the extra stats. Yeah, you're attacking from range. Again, you have low accuracy, but Sheeta can just 
if she gets dogpiled again. Okay, we lucked out and she dodged. I mean, I knew that was going to happen unless she got a crit. So now what I can do is I can have Lena go here and heal up. Play it safe. Now we need to go to the forks and plug them up. Well, I'm gonna try to give Sheeta a KO, but I have another idea. Actually, because I know I know it's gonna get healed anyway, I'm just gonna hand it to Tiki, because I have an idea. So, this entire group is trying to head up here now. Uh, Marth is going here to the village to get Starlight. Julian's just gonna you know, keep moving. All right, over here. Let's see. Uh, someone needs to get rid of this guy first. Actually, can Zane do it? So, 19 minus 12. No, you can't KO. So it's not worth it. Minerva, if you were to do it... Again, attack a 19. Nope, not enough. You can't do it. Alright. Barst, barst it is, then. Uh... Wait. How about... What about Kane? Attack a 22. A 7. Uh, that's 15. Yeah, that'll be 30. That'll be 30. Good. Give him some pills. Alright. Can Zani grab this one? Again, attack of 19... Defense of 7, so 12, 24. Yes! Zane can grab this one. There we go. Okay. Can Barst grab this one? 25 minus 7, yeah, can. With a crit. With a crit. Level 15, skill, luck. And a silver lance, I believe. No silver bow. Duh. Okay. Uh, Lind. 
with probably Thunder, no, Hellfire. 12, 12, 24, yep. And she gets the crit. 10% chance for a crit. Skill, luck, weapon level. Perfect. Agma. Actual Agma. Uh, let's just use, let's use up your steel. You're almost done with it. Good. I'll probably just discard it. Castor doesn't need it, but... 19. 12. Yeah, she can have it. Perfect. Alright. Enemies are cleared out. All the main ones, anyway. So now, I got a plan. You see... We could use some extra EXP for some of my units. And I know this one is a Pegasus Rider. So I leave this one unplugged. But I surround it like here and here. With like... I put Kane here. Abel. Sheeta. And then the rest are plugged. And we can try to feed EXP. And I can maybe do that in the other, on the other side too. You're going up here. We are rushing to the enemy forts. Because I think it's a turn thing. And if that's the case, I want to rush there as soon as possible. here, because I spent a lot of time just waiting around over here. Uh, which one's Zane? This one? He can hang out here. Everyone else get moving. Again, I think there is a secret shop here, and that's what Julian's going to try to find. I can think of two spots. Oh, hey, Marth, it's me, Godo. Oh, look, you brought the stuff. Let's make Starlight. As long as she won't get attacked. The only she would have survived if there was only one enemy. Because she was she was back into her human form. She survived a single hit, it's just that the second one attacked. You stay there. Kane, I need you on the move. Discard the broken one. There we go. Alright. Karst, get moving. Lind, you'll catch up eventually. What's left? Julian. Julian's just kind of doing his thing. And 
the healers are trying to hide in the corner. Because they know their time is up. Okay, let's see. Tiki, plug this one. Lavar, when you head over here, because you can plug that one. Abel, head up here. Mark, you can head up there now, too. moment as if they're gonna pop in. So I am going to do something like this. Do this. Even though I'm pretty sure I have a few more turns to catch up before they spawn in. Ads playing but nothing's happening. So I'll keep going. Checking up here first. Okay. You go here. I want one able here. are done, I just kind of moved everyone where they need to be. Enemies are not here yet. That's good. Castor is getting a little extra healing out of this. Okay. Castor can actually leave for a second because I want Kane here. for next turn. Marth? I might just have Marth... Hmm. Do I want to feed Marth these ones? I'll probably feed Marth this guy. The healers, on the other hand, I might feed to... Sheeta, maybe? Although, if I'm trying to feed her these ones. It's hard to say, like... I want to get Sheeta to at least level 10, and then I might promote her. But I want to also feed kills to Kane and Abel. Who's left? Okay, Julian, is this a secret shop? No, it is not. So we're going over here. Pegasus have arrived. A single one. And you're attacking Kane. Interesting choice. I see why you attack Kane. Kane's gonna need some healing. I wanted Lena over there anyway, just in case something like that happened. Okay. 
Lana, you get over here. There we go. Now, I could probably set the same thing up over here. But honestly, like... Who would I really want to train? On, on this end, no one really needs the training, so I don't really care. You can just wait here. At the moment, everyone's at full health, and we'll see if they'll if the Pegasus will attack Kane again. Okay, we're basically safe. Again, I think there is a secret shop here, and I think it's right there. And then I need to have Julian head over here and do some shopping. All right, let's keep it going. Oh no, more reinforcements. Who are you attacking? You're still attacking Kane, even though Kane's on the fort. That's an interesting choice. Speed, weapon level, defense. Hey, at least Kane's getting the EXP. I honestly want, like, one of those four to get the kill anyway, so it's okay. I'm fine with it. You know what? I think we could probably equip the iron. Yeah, we could probably equip it. Is this one of those cases where... Well, we already defeated the boss, so killing this guy won't do anything. Just double checking. There. I could seize the castle at any time. Mars level 18. Strength, speed, weapon level, and HP. Alright. I could seize the castle at any time. Good. I'm gonna leave the healers alone, honestly, because I might feed them to Sheeta. Because this Pegasus might just keep going after Kane. That's fine. Okay, it's working out. Kane must have less defense or something. Okay, let me check. Your defense is 9, 8? Huh. Abel has less defense, but yet... He's going after Kane. Interesting. Interesting decisions. Uh... I'll let Mark get healed. Doesn't need to do anything for a little bit. Julian? Let's see. There isn't one. Hmm. I thought for sure there's one in this chapter. Well, I need him to go to the shops anyway. Is there another spot there could be one? Hmm. Not sure. Seems that was it for the reinforcements. Granted, I took him to... I don't know. Seems like that was it for the reinforcements. Uh, okay. Sheeta, I will let you go after the healers. That wasn't that many reinforcements. Well, uh, Julian, you need to head to the shops. I need to see what's there.
thought for sure. Uh, I thought for sure that there would have been a uh, secret shop there. By the way, we did skip a chapter. Uh, we fought Kumu last chapter and then this one. There was a chapter in between in the original. Okay, let's see. Is there a secret shop? Or maybe I'm getting confused with a different chapter. Cheetah's level 10. Now I can promote her. How much XP do you have? I might feed the last kill to... You know what? I'll feed it to Kane. Because I'm going to promote Cheetah. I'm just going to promote her now. Alright. Actually, I don't think there is a secret shop here. Might not actually be a secret shop here. Okay. Hey, Joshua, how's it going? Almost done with this chapter. Uh, yeah, not much, not much left. We'll be moving on to chapter what, eighteen? Here in a sec. Just gotta check the shops. Why did I think there was a secret shop here? Um, for some reason, I thought there was a secret shop on this chapter. Book 1, Chapter 17. There is one here. have an achievement who subs uh so i have a sub goal going i just got some emotes uh and so the, and one of them is a uh, tier one where is it so like uh here's the tier one if you're curious uh it's rigged uh but uh I have the sub goal there for, like, because I want to try to get some, uh, channel badges and sub badges, so that's what it's going for. Uh, we hit that, we should be able to get at least some, uh, sub badges. That's why I have it there. What are, oh, what am I playing? <laughs> you said who's sub, so I was confused. Okay, <clears throat> yeah, uh, I am playing Fire Emblem 3. Super Nintendo. This kinda is my first playthrough. I say kinda. Uh, because Book 1 is a remake of Fire Emblem 1. And I have played Fire Emblem 1 before. Book 2, on the other hand, I have not played. So, when we get there, that will be a first playthrough. A true first playthrough, if you will. We promote Cheetah because she's kind of been falling behind lately. Fire Emblem? Like the Bibble? No. I don't think so. Uh, let's see. We got... Okay. I gotta check the shops. And supposedly there's a secret shop here. But I don't know where. Let's check these very quick. What do we got? Uh, ooh, okay, steel stuff. I can finally restock on my steel weapons. How many do I need? If you don't know anything about Fire Emblem, this game has permanent death, so you gotta be strategic. And if you wanna keep a unit, you gotta reset. So a spare one for Navarre. 
We definitely need one for Agma, for sure. Uh, Mark is fine. Uh, anyone else needs steel stuff? We could use a new one for Abel. You just played... Th oh, Three Hopes. Interesting. That's the... Three Hopes is the Warriors game. Okay. Yeah, uh... No, this is Mark's game. And, uh... There's many ways to play this. There's... FE1 on the NES, which... Uh, that one did get a Switch English translation, but you can't buy it anymore. I don't know why they did that. Uh, okay. One, two... I'll buy three, uh... I'll buy three steel... Lances. Uh, steel swords. And two steel lances. Okay, we'll do that. Uh... Then there's this version on the Super Nintendo, which remade Fire Emblem 1, and that's book 1, although five chapters were cut. And uh, then Mars Direct Sequel is book 2, which is in, it's in the same game. It's basically like two games in one. Like this. And then there's also, not only that, there's also the... DS remakes of both those, both, uh, book one and book two, basically. Alright. What do we got? Yeah, I'm just checking shops right now, and then I'm gonna seize the castle. But yeah, uh, book one cut out, like, five chapters, because I'm assuming space limitations. Okay, Armor Slayer, Worm Slayer, Silver Swords, Riders, Banes, Silver Lances, Silver Bows. I don't need either of these. I know I need more of these. I'm going to buy a good... Hmm, well, at least two. I'll buy two of these. Hmm, and I think... No, I don't need that. We'll buy one more, as a spare. There we go. Okay. Check these other shops. And, again, suppose... By the way, I do, uh, I'm using retro achievements. I am getting achievements for this game as I play. And supposedly there's something right here that says there is a secret shop here. But I don't know where it's at. So, I'm gonna try to figure that out. But in the meantime, we're checking the shops first. Of course, no one says anything. No one asked anything about where the chapter, where the secret shop is. Yeah, um... This game is a little clunky. But, so far, this is still not bad game. Uh, Elf Fire. I don't think I need another Heal Staff. Blizzard Fire, Thunder. We're pretty good on those. Do I need Elf Fire? I don't think so. I think we're good. Let's see. And in this shop, what do we got? Bulnaries, Pure Water, Store, Chest, Bridge, Keys. Okay. I should stock up on Volinaries. They have been kind of helpful. Let's see. Who needs a Volinary? Minerva. Abel. Uh, Minerva and Abel. Castor. Uh, Agma's fine. Kane. That's four. Marth, although there's one in storage. I know there's one in storage. I'm thinking four Volinaries? Five Volinaries. Okay. We'll 
by five five sets of Volinaries, and then I should be good. One, two, three, and thanks for the follow, Joshua. What was that? Three, four, and five. Enjoy the enjoy using the five emotes. Uh, at the very least. Okay. I've done most of my shopping. So, again, supposedly, there is a secret shop. But where would it be? Uh, where is it? It would be in a cor- it would probably be tucked in a corner. I thought it was here, but that's not the case. Yeah, I am on chapter 17, I think. How's the sub goal going? I mean, you can see it. <laughs> Again, if we hit it, we should be able to get some channel badges ordered. That's just kind of like the minimum I'm going for. It's weird, like, I'm... Is this chapter 17? Uh, yeah, this is chapter 17. So I don't know what this achievement is talking about. This is one of those... This is one of those cases where I'm not sure what's going on. Hey, Franny, how's it going? Uh... I basically just finished this chapter. However, there is an achievement saying that there is a secret shop in this chapter. But I don't know where it is. You know what? I might actually look this up. Okay, uh... Let me, let me see if I can find it. Secret... Yeah, we're basically done with this chapter. Just need to find the secret shop to figure out where it, and see what they have, but that's about it. Uh, let's try this site. What do we got? Now that's Blazing Sword, but maybe we could find out uh, Mystery of the Emblem. We have a secret shop list. Secret shops. Here we go. 17. Southwest of the map, there's a single hill surrounded by mountains. It, it's here. That's where the secret shop is. Well, time to look. I'm so confused. Alright, uh, I'm gonna send a flyer over there just in case. I don't even know if it has good stuff. But what's going on, Franny? What's going on? By the way, Franny, I don't think you've been here in a few days, but there's emotes! We have emotes now. Chapters away from finishing book one. I have no, t I have no clue if Julian could get to the secret shop. I can always trade with Minerva. Alright, Julian, can you make it there? But, <laughs> what chapter? Are this is chapter seventeen. Uh, moving on to 18 here in a second. Wait. What? Okay, I'm confused. I'm reading it was over here. I'm 
so confused. Oh, duh, you need the... You, you need the card. I'm dumb. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna have to trade both of these. There we go. Only a flyer could get over here. Interesting. Alright, let's see what's in this secret shop. It's a secret! What do you want? Oh, okay. Promotion items. This is a good one. So, I can use two guiding rings. One for each of my mages. I don't think I need anything else. I don't... I don't know if we'll get another guiding ring, but, uh... That's all I will really need. Because we can give one to Merrick. We can give... We can give one to Lind. You're promoted, you're promoted. Yep, yep. You can't promote. It's weird that fighters can't promote. You already have a Knight's Crest. So does Kane. This is kind of my main team. So yeah, I think that's all I need. Let's move on. Prince Marth, I have already found the location of Thabes. To the far north of Caden, at the uh, Mamotor Desert, there appears to be an illusion town. But those who went to Thabes never came back. So what will you do? I must go there to reclaim the Falchion and to rescue my sister. Garneth, watch me. I won't let this beautiful world fall into your hands. Yeah, complete chapter 17. And we just warp. We're doing a lot of traveling. To the northwest. Marth and the others were transported by Arcsage Goto, great. Goto's great warp magic to the ancient city of Thames. At one time, it was a proud town, possessing a vast civilization, and but now it is desolate and lifeless. At the central Thames Tower is the is where the Dark Pontifex Garneth is situated. Marth and the others must recover the lost divine Falchion sword. And they may re they must rescue Princess Elise, who was captured by Garden. So if I remember this chapter, there are three Garnefs. One of them's real. And it's random which one it is. So first one oh, no mouse. Uh, hmm, I'm, you know what, I think that will do, I don't think I need Julian, let try that, let me do that, oh no, I need Julian, I need Julian, okay, uh, let me make a quick save, let's go through items, you're good, you're good, I think you need to trade with Julian. Oh, whoops. Trade with Julian so you can get your steel sword. And then I believe Navar will need one later. Julian, go ahead, deposit the other steel swords. Alright. She does fine. I don't even know. How useful should be. Okay. You need to trade with Minerva. And grab the guiding ring. Right back. Yeah, we're gonna do some inventory shenanigans. Merrick, you also trade. And I think I'll give Oak Shield to 
Sheeta. Because she'll probably be better than Minerva. Who else needed Vulnaries? Okay. We're gonna do a little bit of this. Hold on. Pain, Abel. Needed one. Castor. Let's see. Barst, you're fine. Agma's fine. Merrick. Navar. You don't need the dragon whip. Lind? Uh, I guess it was Lind. And Minerva, go ahead and trade the silver and VIP cards to Julian. There we go. That's done. Oh, wait. Oh, well. That's fine. Make a save. Ads playing here in us right now. Uh, let me take a look around. Three Garnets. And of course that one has a guiding ring. Oh, wait. Uh Lint. Uh you need you need Starlight. Alright, ads playing right now. We got about Kaboom! Kabooms. I will throw out all the bombs, except I don't have any. Actually, wait, I do have bombs. I have these bombs. Alright. Oh, my I need to play Donkey Kong. I haven't played Donkey Kong on the stream yet. Alright. So I do know there are three Garnets. If I remember correctly, one of them has the Fauci on, but we don't know which one. Or maybe I'm thinking of a different version of this. I could just warp Lind. Well, anyway, let's get this started. See how it goes. Pontifex Garneth have been waiting for a long time. It is a shame, but to secure my grasp upon this world, you must die. <laughs> Medeus is under my control. There is nothing to fear. As long as I have the Falchion and Imhulu, even he can't your ears about with my, uh, uh, emperor voice, huh? Well, Marth, you must do battle with my images. The Falchion with will be yours, only if you can defeat the real me. That's my best Emperor Palpatine. It hurts my throat. <sighs> okay. So we gotta defeat his face. And we got the real one there. Um, I remember the DS version. And each of them had a Falchion, but only one of them was real. Granted, they're not here, so I don't know how this works. Uh, let's see. Lena. We're gonna have you start warping. Warp. Let's see. One side at a time, maybe? Just focus on one side. That kind of sounds like a plan. I gotta be careful about using Starlight. Don't wanna use too much. It only has 12 uses. Although I could repair it. I think I could repair it. We 
makes you have a heart attack. It, yeah, it, it does to me too, but in a different way. Have you not played Wind Waker? Attack of 15. What's your attack speed? 7, so we can't double. Because that Wind Waker minigame where that sound... Oh, this is not going to work. Okay. Um. Ah, my, my, my hopes and dreams have been dashed. This is Guiding Ring. Yeah, uh, the kaboom sound effect is from uh, Wind Waker. And it's the minigame where you have to basically play a game of Battleship. And... Kaboom! Within like a certain amount of turns, and it's it's not fun to get that heart piece. But I like the sound effect. Yeah, it gives me a heart attack, but in a different way. It just gives me war flashbacks to trying to get that heart piece. I guess we'll just focus on one side. Castor, do your job. I, I, I see a reset on the horizon because I was not expecting Starlight to fail so, so beautifully. That was such a beautiful way for my hopes and dreams to fail. It's just like, oh yeah, Starlight, we can finally just ignore their defense and like, oh wait, no, we still have resistance. Great. Just fantastic. Well, there doesn't seem to be any thieves here. That's interesting. Well, time to waste more starlight. I have hammer, so it's not a big deal. Well, at least we got a crit. So it wasn't as big as a waste as I thought it was going to be. Ah, going after Agma. Oh, Navar. I get confused. They're both heroes. Even though Navar really should be a mercenary. Or Myrmidon, whatever. Swordsman, that's the word. Swordmaster. Oh, you know, Navarre, Navarre is every class, you know? Alright. Castor are doing a good job. Okay. So, uh... Hopefully he's not being healed for that one damage. Uh, Lind, you, you should... You should do the thing. Oh no, you need the extra damage. I'm too boring. Oh no. Whatever shall I do about that? Do you want me to fake it and be like, oh my god, this is so interesting? I can, I, I, everyone would think that's fake and be too boring. Or, no, not as interesting. I think faking it and it being obvious that it's fake is not as, not as good at just, you know, being me, I guess. Maybe I need to stream at night. Because if my voice is enough to put you to sleep, it'd probably be a better use. Master, level 5, skill and luck boost. Let's see. 
Uh, okay. Let's try Elfire. Attack of 13, attack speed of 4. You can't deal any damage. Thanks. Thanks, Merrick. It's not like I promoted you for a reason. Alright, I'll send you the other way. Uh... Oh, come on, go up here. I'll get there eventually. Lena... You're doing good. Let's see, Sheeta... I think everyone else can just kind of do that. Julian's just kind of here. All right, let's see how this goes. Let's see how this goes. And no one's doing anything. Okay, so caster. Wait, do you need healing? Ah, uh, not yet. You don't need healing yet. Let's use your steel. See how this goes. Perfect. All right. Let's see how well Starlight does. You have an attack of 17, attack speed of 9. I can double. Three damage. Thanks. But I shouldn't be able to even hurt this guy because of in Hulu, right? Because of Hulu, I can't hit him. No. Okay, never mind. The clones don't have that problem. The real one does. Whatever. Okay. Merrick? Go after the... I can have him go after the general, right? Yeah, as long as... As long as I don't actually KO him right now. Let me see. Uh, Thunder. No, Elfire. 13, 10. Yeah, not enough to KO. So I could go ahead and attack. Okay, let's see. secret shops here. We are a promoter of mages. So we'll get rid of Garnet on the other side. Navar, head over there. This isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. So let's see. Navar can handle that. Castor can actually handle both mages. Uh, I'm going to have... Yeah, Marth and... Uh, Ogma, go after this. Alright, Marth, you're up. You have Mercurius? Yes. Lind? Well, I thought Lind was gonna do some more out of that. Never mind. Wait, who are you? Oh, you're healing the general. Okay. I guess we'll hold off on he on fighting the general at the moment. Oh, okay. You can't double. I should have left the iron one on equipped. Mark can actually do something now. I've given him enough levels, because he was kind of falling behind a lot. Granted, he just wasn't getting the strength boost. That was just holding him back. Let's 
Defense, level 19, Skill, Defense, and HP. Do they have the same movement? No. I can have Agma up here. Caster, if you were to attack, you probably will die. Uh, attack 26. Never mind, he's not gonna die. Castor has the exact attack. Perfect. That works out. Okay, Lena, yeah, you need to go and heal Castor. You heal him next turn. And in treasure chest in the treasure chest we get a bunch of gold. That helps. Uh, let's see. I have nothing at the moment. We'll hold off on fighting the general at the moment. Uh, what is your range? Okay, right here. Castor is going to fight the mages. Or at least one of them. Uh, that should be good. Honestly, Kane, Abel, and Cheetah are just kinda here. They're here to exist. They're not really doing much. Augment's level 2, Strength, Weapon, and HP. Did you know Fire Emblem had an OVA? Yeah, apparently it had like two episodes made for like Fire Emblem 1. Uh, I've seen it. It's not that great. But it really only covered like the first, like what, two chap- Like kind of two chapters. Actually, maybe three, because the second one covers uh, Navarre's introduction. But it doesn't go farther than that. I think it was- it was an OVA. I think probably just to see if it would have done well. Clearly it didn't. But I uh, I do remember that Gordon was very annoying in that OVA. I kind of did that on purpose. Alright. We can set... I think we can set Mark here. Attack of 18. Yeah, okay. We can do that. Uh, we'll hold off on the general here in a second. Actually, we'll... Yeah, we'll keep him there. Did I move Julian? I did not. Granted, it's been a while since I've seen that OVA, but I did watch it. I don't even know if it- I don't even remember if it's one of those it's so bad it's good, it's just like, it's kinda dull. Not much to it. Not to say a Fire Emblem show couldn't work, it's just I do feel like it's kinda hard to do. Level 6, Speed, Weapon, and HP. Let's see. Mark's doing fine. One more attack and that'll do. And then I could get Ogma to go and attack the general. Well, thanks for the spoiler achievement. Because I am now level 20. Speed, defense, and HP. Marth is at max level. He cannot level up anymore. Let's see. Do I? S yeah, I still have an armor slayer. 33. Let's go ahead and weaken him. Hellfire. 
again. Armor Slayer, let's go. Alright. What do we got now? One more mage. Can Castor make it over there? No. Just go ahead and do this. What's his attack? 11? Caster will survive. Then we're gonna have to, like, start sending in the bar and bars to attack. Uh, we'll have Lena heal Castor here after this. But honestly, Lind could use a heal. She's gonna need to be out there. I remember when I, I think when I played DS version, or maybe it was when I was playing uh, NES, that I just warped, so, warped Lena over with Starlight and just attacked one of the bosses, got Falchion, and then just leave. Like, it was hilarious. Uh, you can just do that. of the general. We'll see if that's enough. Okay. Your range, if I have someone here or here they can attack, Oh, wait! I didn't realize these guys are Garnet too. Oh, you have an Hulu. I see the confusion. I see where the confusion is now. Okay. I didn't think... I thought there were only three clones. Because I, I think I remember there being only three, but I guess not. All right, I need to... Almost a full heal. And Julian keeps moving. Alright. Uh, I think I should try to get out of, out of the way of Thor on here for six minutes. Or six. Try to get uh, characters out of the way if possible. Which Agma can't. Can you heal? Yeah, we're gonna need that. Okay, right over here. There we go. That should work out okay. Let's see how it goes. Oh, Dark Mages. Okay. I had a feeling there'd probably be reinforcements, but I wasn't too... wasn't 100% sure. Yeah, it's a good thing I healed. Ah, same turn reinforcements. Luckily, I'm far away. Is that guy another Garnet, or is he just a Dark Mage? 
that's soon. No, he's just a dark mage. Alright, let's see. Oh, wait. No, Marth has a point in resistance. He has a single point in resistance. Okay. Wait, what's my attack? 32 minus 6. Yeah, we should be good. Oh, I did my math wrong. Huh. Let me get this topped up. Trusty. And there we go. Try that again. Okay. So now I have a better idea of what I need to do. Let's see. So I could bring in Tiki instead of Sheeta. And I could warp. The question is, is that worth it? Because Starlight is only meant to stop in Hulu. I. However, because he's that's the only one where I need to attack with Starlight. I'm guessing Meteors is one of those uh, attack from ten range. Yeah, I got Tiki. Uh. I might bring her in. I might warp her... Where would I want to warp her? Maybe over here? What is your range? Because I, I gotta be a little bit careful. Wait, it's not letting me say he's gonna move. Okay, he has six movement. Six. Okay, so if I warped Tiki here... If I work Tiki here, she's in range. No, the boss is Garneth. We have we have like six Garnefs here. Actually, no. Yeah, we have six Garnefs here. We have six Garnef. Uh, five of them are clones. This one, I think, is the real one. And he has the Falchion. We need to hit him with Starlight. But because he has so much resistance, this might be a case where you hit him with Starlight and then everyone else can hit him. I forget. Not play the opening. So, now that I know... Now that I have a better idea of what I need to do. I'm gonna let Caster go ahead and just attack this guy. And then we got the reinforcements that are gonna show up afterwards. Okay. I can set Lind in range of both of these mages. Have her start heading over here. I want to make sure she's equipped with... Actually, what would let her attack twice? Elfire's fine. It's not the best, but at least she can fight back. Yeah, she's equipped with Elfire. Let's go ahead and use the Guiding Ring. Skill, speed, defense, resistance went up by three. That might help with damage. Navar? Yeah, Navar can head this way. Uh, let's set him here. Merrick? 
send him over to the right. Go ahead and use the Guiding Rune again. Because let's be honest, they're not going to get many more levels after this anyway. Strength, skill, speed, defense, resistance. Okay. So while Castor is dealing with this guy, and then he's going to be dealing over there, I'll probably have Merrick go over here and try to weaken them. Marth can go ahead and head this way. Kane and Abel are just more or less kind of here at the moment. Farce can head to the right. Okay. I could try to send Tiki up here. Let's try it. It's not gonna hurt anything. Alright. Let's try warping. Go, Tiki, you got this. You can survive, like, three sets of attacks. Right? Oh, thanks for the two, uh, the two gifted subs, Franny. Thank you. That goes to the... That will go towards the... Uh, oh, what was it? Uh, that that will go towards the channel point badges. Thank you. We're on the way there. Agma's gonna head to the right. Now, like, yeah. There's a little help with this. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, that is just kind of like the minimum ask that it, that, uh, that Twitch recommended I set it as. I'm like, okay, well, that's probably a good idea. That's more of like, if that, if only that is filled, it'll be just enough to get a good, maybe uh, a good few badges to last a little bit. If I wanted the big ass, I would have set the total for like 60 or 50, 50 or 60. But I'm like, nah. Wait, no. Thank you, Franny. Thank you. I'm thinking after we get the badges done, maybe a couple more emotes. But after that, I want to try to make this look better. <laughs> like this overlay. But that is a big ask. That's something I'm not going to worry about for a while. Okay, let's see how well Tiki does. And... Wow. That sucks. Oh, I'm like, how did she take damage? I didn't catch that she got attacked by meteors. And I didn't realize Lind was uh, this close. And... Oh, at least she doubles. You know what? I'm fine with that. I can live with that. And watch as Tiki... dies. Unless she, unless she makes the 11% dodge. Come on, Tiki. You can do it. Make that 11%. Nope. Okay. Okay. <laughs> And that's a death. Right now we're at 46 deaths in total. So yeah, sending Tiki up there at least right away is not the best idea. At the very least, if I'm going to warp her up there, I got to wait for her to be able to attack in the same turn. Yeah, the Pyrrhus Pokemon. Yeah, that's just uh, stream avatars. Uh, it's just kind of a cool thing that I have set up. Uh... 
sadly, there aren't that many Fire Emblem ones. But if you are curious and you want to change your uh, avatar, you can totally do that. I think you just need to scroll down a little bit, and there'll be a stream avatars option. Okay, let's try this again. So, she got attacked by meteors and these two. 35, and your attack is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I could set her here. She would get attacked by this guy, but that's it. Hmm. That's a idea. And then eventually, uh, fly down. Does anyone have a spare set of- yeah. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Alright, let's go ahead and trade. Uh, probably the full set of all nice. I know, I should- I should buy it. I should have bought a spare set. Right, Caster, you go right ahead. You go here. Use your iron bow. But yeah, I have mine set up as Heracross because a while back I did a challenge where I got every ribbon you could get on a single Pokemon and I decided to go with Heracross. Okay, so I needed Lin to like stand here. Okay. I see. I see the mistake I made. So I chose Heracross as my on-screen avatar just to kind of represent, you know? It was a very, very long challenge to get all the... to get all of the ribbons. Actually, is Lena able to... No, I don't want her to get the KO anyway. Not right now. Marth. Go here. Magma over here. Let's see. I think I'm just gonna have Lena kind of stand in the middle. Oh, I didn't have her... I should have had her transform. I don't know why I didn't. I think I just messed it up. Alright. You go right ahead and use the guiding ring. Skill, speed, defense, resistance. Alright. And Julian, I guess you'll just kind of hang out here. So Caster should get attacked by the hunter, the, or the sniper this time. And won't get the KO, but we'll weaken him pretty good. Oh, wait, no, I think that's exactly enough. Yeah, there we go. Go Lena. Is this enough, too? I think it might be. And Lena... Uh, Linda's dodging like a champ. It is too bad, though, that... Since we promoted her, she kind of lost her unique sprite. Now she's just the generic, uh, you know, mage. It's a little disappointing. She actually had a unique sprite. I, okay, um, that's kind of dumb. That, that deserves a, uh, that's a rigged. That's rigged. That was dumb. 
Of course, Caster gets hit by a crit. Ah, uh, all right. Time to try that again. Okay, one one change. Uh, Lind. She trades the Volunary over to Tiki, just so she has one. Let's make a save. Alright. Let's try that again. Okay, promote. Yeah, this first turn is going to be annoying, isn't it? Because of how many uh, promotions I need to do. Alright, Tiki, I'm going to have you transform. We'll do that now. It is actually fun to use a dragon in this game. The fact that it just lasts a few turns makes it a lot more interesting than what it normally is. Like in, like, Fire Emblem... Uh, back in some of these Fire Emblem games, uh, where, like, oh, it, the, the Dragon Stone has, like, 50 uses, and every time you attack, it goes down, and you can't get another one, so you better use it wisely. Sacred Stones. But the fact that it's like, oh, it has 18 uses, but you transform and you stay in that form for like a good five turns. That makes it a little bit more interesting. If you were gonna have a breakable, like, dragon stone, basically. Jeez, how come I did so well on my first attempt? Eric, you go over here. Honestly, as much as I like my mages, I'm starting to wonder if it was even worth it having Merrick. Granted, Excalibur did help whenever it popped up, but I'm starting to wonder if I would have been better off with having even Gordon on the team instead. Lynn should, uh, Lynn should have this. Oh, and you know, with the crit, that works too. Hunter should go after Castor, and let's just hope he doesn't get the crit. At least it's not going to be guaranteed. If this was the GBA ones, it probably would be. There we go. Things are on the right track. So I just kind of realized when doing the map, even though he attacks twice with the with the iron, I end up using three attacks this way. Whereas with if I go steel then iron, that's just a total of two. So that's better. Let's go to do that instead. Save uses. Level five, speed, weapon level, and HP. You could be healed later. I want to make sure I'm out of range of you. Okay. I'll go ahead and let Merrick go ahead and stand. Uh, he can stand here. Uh, we want... We want Elfire. 
Alright. Lena. We're gonna try warping. Probably not a good idea. Let's go up here. Actually, I probably could have just warped her last turn, now that I think about it. If I wasn't getting an attack. Yeah, I could have warped her last turn. So yeah, she'll get attacked by you, but mm, hopefully no one else. Navar, we're gonna get rid of this healer. Next turn, Marth, you head up here. We're gonna start dealing with the heroes. Here, Caster is gonna get healed next turn. Lind is fine. She's fine. What's going on over here? Everyone else just kind of needs to wait. Let's see how this goes. Come on, Tiki, you can handle this. Oh, he's running away. He knows he's in danger. But he knows that's where the reinforcements are going to show up. Which is leading me to my doom. Alright. Merrick should be able to handle this. not gonna make it. Yeah, I knew it. He needed one more point in... What, magic? No, there's no magic. Resistance? Whatever boosts magic attack in this game. I'm not sure which. Come on, Tiki. Yeah, I knew that was gonna be a problem. But at least she's out of range of meteors. So that works out for her. Okay, over here. I want... I'm not going to do anything. Navar, you need to head up here. Marth is going to go ahead and start working on this one. No, not the Volinary. What am I doing? Yeah, you have, you have the right sword. Okay. Next. I could feed this one to Merrick? Or I could give it to... Well, I, I don't know. I don't know. Caster, if I use the silver, I get one hit KO. There's that. Now let's go ahead and heal. And the mage, I guess I'll hand the KO to Merrick. Who knows, maybe he could get an extra point in, like, resistance or whatever boosts magic in this game. I'm actually not sure what it is. I normally love my mages, but not so much in this particular game. <laughs> right here. Let's get Ogma right here. Yeah, that works out. Julian, you go here. Tiki, go ahead and attack. You'll get the KO. You should get the KO. There we go. Good. Okay, so next turn, she will need to use a Volinary. 
That's only for 20 wood. Yeah, that's only for 20 HP. Let's see. Uh, your attack is 19. What's your res? 10. So 9 damage. What's your 26 attack? Well, she might be hanging out here for a little bit. Because I'm going to be in range of two attacks. She'll probably have to Volinary twice. Just to get to full health. Just so she can survive. Yeah, just so she can survive two hits. That's not annoying at all. Alright. Uh, can't enable, just kind of hand here. Here, everyone's fine. Too bad you don't have the. Too bad you don't have the heal staff. Now that I think about it. I should have bought some heal staff. I didn't. I didn't even think about that. Merrick and uh, Merrick and Lind could have started a heal. You get some exp that way. Dang it. If I did this right, the iron bow should be enough. Unless last time it was more of like I got a strength boost and that's what made it. Oh, so close. He needs like one more experience. Look at that. Okay, 2 EXP. My bad. Mark, you can attack this guy. Navar. Oh, come on. Really? That's dumb. Okay. If you attack with the iron, 26 damage. 16, yep, exact damage. Perfect. You start heading this way. Same thing with Barst. Merrick. Alright. Julia, you're gonna open the chest. Uh, Lena, you're going to. Actually, you're gonna target the general with Volgana. There we go. Yeah, she do it. Oh, I didn't. I thought she could double. Never mind. Uh, you can't heal. All right. I guess that's that's that. Oh yeah, Tiki. Right. Use your Volinaries. I'm just picturing the idea that Tiki is currently. Uh, what she's doing is she's just like she's in the dragon form, but she has the tiny little ball and just kind of. I had to use her nails to drink this tiny little potion. Go, Marth. 17% crit. Almost there. Strength, speed, weapon level, resistance, and HP. Okay. Well, he's not running away. He knows he's not going to make it past this. 27, 21. Okay. Yeah, we're good. Now watch as, at the end of this turn, the reinforcements arrive, and Navar's going to get attacked by two mages. And he can't defend himself. Magma. Go right ahead and use your probably steel. Let me double check. 22 minus 16. You double. Yeah, you're fine. Get 
rid of the healers. Both healers are gone. We got a Draco shield. That's extra defense. That's just extra defense. Alright, now I can just continue going after the mage. Ah, he didn't even get the full health. Okay, Caster, you go right ahead and start heading this way, I guess. Merrick is probably going to have to pre prep for the mages. Uh, as well as... I'm going to I'm going to have Lena head this way. Because we need Lind to prepare for this Garnet. Probably have this one go over here and attack Agma. Alright, you need to back out. Let's see how it goes. The reinforcements show up? Not yet. Not yet. That's good. Navar, start heading back. Lena! Get the KO. Okay. Julian, you need to open the other treasure chest. Let's see. What's your range? Okay, one above forest. Okay, Agma, prepare for the killing edge. And let's see, I need healing done, so. Casper's not good. Alright. Alright, reinforcements are not here yet. That's good. Oh, he. Wow. Akma got hit by a crit, but he was so tanky. He only took, like, nine damage out of that. Good job, Agma. Good job. You can tank that hit. Alright. Now it's the Garnets. Oh, did I... Okay. And you use a Ball Mary. We're probably gonna have to transform next turn. I messed up. Alright. I'm gonna you head over here. Or, my ball. My bad. Lena, over here. Let's see. I think we're gonna wait it out. Because I know there's gonna be another set of reinforcements. This Garnet should probably attack. He's gonna attack a 19. Should probably attack Merrick. Even though Merrick can't survive. Although, we could have him attack Castor. Actually, Castor might be better. So, you have an attack of 19. Your attack speed's 3. I think no matter what I do, I'll be good. Hold on. So, defense of six. Caster could just get the KO. As long as he doesn't get hit by a crit or something. So, mini caster. Right? One square over. Tiki, you already healed yourself. Alright. Oh, Julian needs to move. I'm gonna have to go ahead and get Barst. And Agma closer. Merrick, you can just kind of hang out here. 
Alright. And here are the Dark Mages. I don't know how long these guys are gonna last. I'll probably have Navarre go after them. And Merrick should have these guys covered. Okay, good. So Castor can go ahead and stand one square here. I need... I need Lin to heal. I need Lin to be healed. Because we need to bait the other one. I'm gonna go ahead and let Navar get this one. 27... 4? 31 minus 4. That's enough for a one-hit KO. There we go. Get rid of him. Get him out of here. Strength, luck, weapon level, and HP. Alright. Tiki needs to transform again. However, we set her two squares down. So you have an attack of 19. Oh, this is so hard to tell right now. I think Tiki was able to survive. She just can't survive three hits. It works. And if Tiki dies because of this, then warping, at least in this sense, won't really help me. Alright. I need Lin to bait this one out. Lynn, go right ahead and stand here. Marth. Actually, Kane and Abel, I don't think they're going to be that useful. Maybe. Yeah, they could be. Hold on. Oh, oops. Okay, Julian, you head this way. L5. Is this enough? We have attack speed of 4. I can double this guy, but not this guy. Resistance of 5. Attack of 10, resist of 5, but I double. No. Let's just go with L5. It's probably not going to boost your magic. Alright. I think that's it. Is it just those three? Yep. Alright. Let's see if this goes well. More Dark Mages! That's not good. Okay, Tiki's getting attacked by Meteors. Yep, nine damage. Too bad I'm not gonna I'm not gonna waste meteors. I'm not gonna have them run out. Oh, Caster dodged! And we got a crit. Good job, Caster. You're pulling your weight. Level six. Speed, weapon level, resistance, HP. Okay. So I know she could survive this. We're just kind of baiting him over. Yeah, I kind of figured. Too bad I don't have aura anymore. Okay, 
right, let's see how this goes. Come on, Tiki. And... Yep, okay, good. 23. She took 14 damage, I believe, right? minus 12, so that is 14. If I heal up, if I stand here, and I go ahead and use my last Volinary, Tiki will uh, be able to get this KO. Yep, I need to heal Lind. needs to go right here. Lena needs to heal. Get her at full health. Perfect. Five strength. She got strength. It's good for healing, I guess. Alright. Marth, you need to... Are you level 20? Not yet. Uh, how well can Abel do? At least Abel has a point of resistance. Kill. Perfect. We even got a crit too. No kill like overkill. Okay. I'm gonna have Kane back out here just so he doesn't get hit. Julian. Get over here. On this end, uh, I need to make sure I back out. I need to make sure I back it. Alright. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. So I need to at least stand here. At this point, I think I'm gonna have Bogma help out with the mages. Exactly enough res. Exactly enough res. All right, let's keep going. More dark mages. This is just to get him away from the real Garnet. Tiki should survive this. There's no chance to crit. And... There we go. There we go. Tiki's done her job, I guess. I mean... Could have been better, but she did a job. Oh, good. Magma dodged. Might have Barst and Caster have that one, too. Yes, 
go go ahead and attack Navarre. It's going to work. And how how long are these reinforcements are going to show up? I wonder how many more turns. You know, it's too bad. You know, this game has a warp staff, but there's no return staff. I wonder when they thought about the return staff. Is it genealogy? Did genealogy come up with the return staff? And Merrick for the crit. brought him over. If Marth were to go in and attack for 33 minutes, okay, Marth can get the KO. Let's heal him up first. Martha's wealth level 20 again skill and HP all right Navar get rid of this guy also you think there would have been a bishop on both ends They're not just two mages on the other side yeah, what's your HP I can't heal what is your attack, actually? Eight? Only a single point of damage. Okay. She can help deal with the... Uh, mages. And she dodged anyway. Of course she gets the crit on the wrong turn. Two, skill, luck, weapon level, HP. Okay. Julian. The chest. Got a bunch of gold. And Julian's done. Can enable should just back out so they can be healed. Um over here. Barst can't make it yet. No, wait. Hand axe! Come on, Barst, you got this. Get that 77%. Yeah. Go, Barst. Alright. Navar. Wait. Castor. I know you need healing. But we could probably give you a kill. 23. No, he's good. We could just use the steel. Perfect. Right, Castor! just kind of hoping that these reinforcements will end soon. But we're about ready to go after Garnef himself. Or at least the one with Ulu. I know Navarre's going to need healing, but he can tank. He's able to tank and dodge. Yeah, nothing there. Okay. 
Oh wow, Merrick's gonna take a single point in damage. That's scary. Ah, uh, yep. Hellfire's not strong enough. Merrick, again, Merrick needs one more point in attack. Or resistance, whatever it is. Julian, you need to back out. You're done. You're done. I need to heal someone. Var, go ahead and do your thing. So we need to get ready. I could look up how long the reinforcements last. No, I can't risk that. I can't risk that. Let's see. Land, mm. go here. And where's your reach? Alright. I'm getting a call. Hold on. Sorry about that. All right. Um, so Mark needs to back out so he can get healed. So does Cain and Abel. I don't really want them to get attacked. But Abel's fine where he's at. Mark, you need to back out. We'll get you healed. Luckily, Julian has another heal staff on him. should be enough. He's strong enough. Besides, he's at 2 HP anyway. Okay. That's good. That's good. I think I'll just leave it there. More Dark Mages. How long is this going to last? want to get rid of them. But Navarre has this covered at the moment. Hmm. Maybe I can heal Lin, and then we can start going after Garneth. Yep. 
Navar is doing great. Oh no, I should have had the hand axe equipped. Oh well. I just realized Bars has a point of resistance. I mean, it's not much, but he does. Wait, why? Oh, okay. He probably can't attack Bars. And of course, there. Oh no, we get a crit. Never mind. and continue getting rid of this Dark Mage. Perfect. My dog- Molly, what are you doing? You're being weird. She's being weird, I think. She's just kind of making a bed for herself. Alright. Uh, yeah, I'll just let the first have this. It's not hurting anything. Sixteen strength, speed, luck, defense, and HP. All right. So now is the real thing. I need to heal up Wind. I want Mark nearby. I need to heal up Wind. sure she's at full health. And where are we at? What's your damage? 24 with your resistance of 7. She can tank a single hit. What is your attack speed? 0. That's a good sign. Let's equip Starlight. Next turn. Next turn. Bait him over. Okay. I'll actually keep Julian nearby. So I can trade when needed. Uh, Tiki's fine. Okay, let's just, let's just leave it here. Oh, they mages. How long are they going to keep spawning? Navarre's probably going to need to back out soon. Or I just need to use a Volinary. That'll work too. Yeah, I might just give him a Volinary. Come on, dodge. No, okay, yeah, he needs, a, he needs to heal. You know what? I may even have Lena help out. Yeah, he's at his limit. I should check what turn I'm at. I was, I was so tempted to look at the, the amount, of amount of turns, but no, I'm going to leave it. Turn 13. I have a feeling we got until turn 15. I want you here. Lena, go ahead and, like, heal him up. Oh, I could have used Physic. Oh, well. I could use Physic. Yeah, that's something. Alright, we're about ready. Lind, stand here. Marth, get close. Okay. 
Okay. Magma. We're about ready to fight. I want I, again, I wonder if this is a case where you just need to, you just need to use Starlight a single time. Then you can just keep hitting with anything you want. Tiki's fine. Uh, okay, let's go. Any reinforcements? Yes, more Dark Mages. And here we go. <laughs> Those that dare to wield weapons against me will die. I'll show you the horrors of my ceiling magic. Imhulu. <laughs> oh, we dodged. That's good. The starlight. So, does starlight get like a power boost when you're fighting against him, Hulu? Or, you know, we just get a crit. That works. That just works out. Never mind. Who cares? And we got the Falchion. I don't believe it. Damn Starlight. Ah, but remember this. You may have bested me, but you won't be able to defeat Medeus with your puny strength. <laughs> I will be patiently awaiting you in hell. On the run. Uh, let's go ahead and split Blizzard in storage for now. Now we just got the Garneth with meteors, and that's it. He shouldn't be too hard to take down, actually. Of course, that one's protected now. Okay, Barst, you're doing good. Yeah, oh, you're attacking Barst again, okay. Go ahead and do your thing. You two got this covered. No kill like overkill. Luck, weapon, and HP. Alright. Barst? You're gonna need a new iron axe. Luckily, we have plenty. Starlight anymore. You Meteors is one of those ones that attacks from range. So what we can do is I'm gonna have Lind go ahead and trade. We're gonna give him the Falchion. Replace the rapier. And he has no weapon durability. What is your defense? Or your uh, attack? 19. We'll survive. What's your attack speed? Good, good. Double checking. 
more setting up. Alright, Lynn, Lena, um, can we get rid of a 29, yeah, we can get rid of this guy in one hit. Get this one. Perfect. Level five. We got luck, defense, and HP. Uh, Julian, you can move back away. These two really didn't get to do anything. Alright. Oh, I, I, I forgot. I gotta be careful. I still have to take it down the archer. In the general. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Well, luckily, I dodge. I can make this work. Wait, I don't think more reinforcements showed up. Yeah, I think we're done with reinforcements. So that's good. Close up. So Marth will be safe in this case. What's your range? You two have the same spots. Two, three. Okay. How would I want to make this work? What's your attack? 23. 23 and 26. Sixteen and thirteen. Is that wait, isn't that twenty-nine? That's twenty-nine. Thirteen attack speed. Seven. Okay. Hmm. I think Marth can make it. If we go up here. Uh that okay, I see. Has a way weaker attack power. Let's just use this. But it's good against dragons, so we don't need the Worm Slayer. Well, we got rid of the last Garneth. Marsh should be fine, and we could seize the throne next turn. Silver Sword, get rid of this one. Unless... Unless... Uh, he gets hit by crit. That would be the only thing. Lena, go right ahead and attack. Get rid of that one. Perfect. So, I just realized something. Is Starlight limited to who can equip? I always thought Starlight can only be used by Lind. Or is that just Aura specifically? Because I could have had Lena do fine. Like she might have been better. Alright. I'll probably end the chapter early. Getting everyone, getting rid of everyone. Oh no, Mark dodged. That helps. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, okay, never mind. 
mind. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna have Mark seize the throne. Because I don't need any of these other kills. Go right ahead, seize the throne. Marth! I've missed you so much! Look at how you've grown. Father must be very happy. Sister, after discovering that you have been taken by Garnef, I was extremely worried. I'm glad you're safe. Garnef captured me so that he can obtain the Resurrection Staff, Om, from Goto. If this staff is used at the temple south at Doluna, it can allow any person to come back to life. Let's go, Marth, to bring back the most important, important person that you lost. Let's go to Doluna. Doluna. There we go. Let's go ahead and make the save. Uh, we're going to keep going. However, I'm going to take a quick break. And I'm gonna refill my water. Uh, you know, and do a few things. I'll let that get to the text box. Look at how we were kind of jumping around in the last couple chapters. Alright, be right back.
Okay, I am back. I got some water, let Molly out, and all that. Alright. <clears throat> Deluna is shrouded in a veil of mystery. A kingdom of maniquettes. Everything started with the resurrection of the Shadow Dragon Medeus at this country. The continent of Organeo was ruined but from endless warring. Many tragic tales have been born and destroyed. But time flows fast. Medeus' admissions of Maniquettes ruling the world must finally end. And Mark's journey must also reach its final destination. So, on my playthrough of the NES version when I was playing on the Switch, I got to this chapter and I just kind of stopped. <laughs> no reason, I just kind of did. That, that looks about right. That looks about right. Let's see. Uh, Bars? You know what? Okay, let's take a look. Bars, go ahead. Let's trade. Where's, uh, there's board. Where's that? Here, have a full set of iron. Uh, I don't think we'll need to replace that armor slave just yet. Cane and Abel are fine, I think. Castor's fine. Navarre will be fine for now. Mark, you currently have... Okay, hold on, let me check something. So, weight of 10... No, might of 10. Okay, 10, 80, 4, 7. Ah, take a look. The Worm Slayer and the Falchion have the same power, but the Falchion is heavier, but more accurate. That's interesting. That's an interesting choice. I think I'm still better off with the Falchion because I don't have to worry about weapon durability. And the Worm Slayer can go to someone else now. So I think that's probably a good idea. Yeah, you're fine. Wait, what's your items look like? Julian has the other heal staff for now. So we're fine there. Hellfire, Excalibur, Thunder Blizzard. Tiki doesn't have anything. Let's deposit the rib here. You need to grab Blizzard out of the storage. There we go. That works. Sheeta's fine. Minerva's fine. Zani's here. I think that's pretty good. Let me check items very quick. I think this is our last chapter where we're outdoors. So I think by the end of this, Kane and Abel should promote. No matter what level they actually are. But I think I want to try to feed them EXP if possible. Oh yeah, Sheeta has the Iot Shield. Now she won't take super effective damage. Highness, look, that is Medeus' castle. He finally reached it. But why hasn't Medeus left the castle to fight? According to Goto, Medeus hasn't completely resurrected. Therefore, he can only assume dragon form inside his castle, where the power of the seal does not affect. Power of the seal? Yes, I don't really understand either. But it seems it was created by the deities to protect humans from the evil dragon tribes. 
In this world, there exists something known as the Binding Shield. I have heard of that as well. It is, it is mentioned in the legends of the Guardian God Naga. But I thought it was all just a myth. If the Binding Seal truly exists, then why has Medeus appeared? Oh, that's, uh, I... Anyway, now is our chance. Before he resurrects completely. Yes, we, we've come all this way, and we're so close to returning peace. Okay, let's go to Deluna. Oh, and this guy's transforming right now. All right, Magic Dragon. Not that will make a difference. All right. So, yeah, we got a lot of dragons here. So many Durgans. Uh, I could actually just tra transport, like, Lena or someone else with the... Actually, wait a minute. I could transform Tiki. She has Ice Breath. I, I don't know. I don't know if that's a good idea. Over here... We got a treasure chest. That's the resurrection one. With all these forts here, it makes me think there's going to be reinforcements. You know, I said I was probably going to try to train Cain and Abel. With all these dragons here, that's going to be very hard to do. It's going to be very hard. Let's check these shops. What do we got? Killer, Worm Slayer, Silver, Fire's Bane, Silver, Silver, okay. Maybe God. Uh, Dorky, Fire, Thunder, Blizzard, L Fire, Heal and Recover. You know what? You know what I think would be a good idea? Oh! I didn't even realize Elise was here. Okay, a last minute healer. That's a cleric. I mean, to be fair, she had been stuck in the in that locked in that room for two years. She couldn't really train. I guess. And we have Alm, we can revive someone. Anyway. You know what I'm going to do? Lind? I want you to trade. I want you to grab both of these. Now I'm gonna have Julia go ahead and buy two more heal staffs. One for Lena eventually, and one for Merrick. There we go. Perfect. There might be a sh secret shop on this map. Hmm, gee, I wonder where it is. We're gonna need a flyer. Okay. So someone could cross through. But who? Honestly, sending Tiki that way might not be the worst idea. And then we'll just send Navarre as backup. At least Tiki will be able to fly, so that will help. Tiki will help deal with the dragons. Does Navarre still have the worm slayer? Yes, that will work out. Cain and Abel go this way. I'm gonna have Lin follow them. Because she currently has the heal staff. Actually, I'll send Merrick too. Lena stays over here. Uh, I'm looking through. Um, yeah, it's a good thing I sent my mages over here. Or two of them. Alright. Castor, you follow. 
I think I want my flyers to go this way. Oh wait, there's a thief there. I just saw that. Okay. He's trying to get all the way over here. And Sheena might be able to stop him. We'll see, we'll see. Agma? I think I'm gonna have my on-foot fighters uh, head through the southern section here. And Zane and Elise are just kinda here. Dragons are on the move. Now that's going to be a problem. When I think about it. The archers are going to double uh, Tiki. Depending on where she sits, maybe she'll only get attacked by one. But then she's gonna get attacked by a dragon. Hmm. Let's see. Be the best option. Okay. Tiki can already just fight one of the archers. But she can't double, so she can't get a KO. She can deal 43 damage to a dragon, which is not enough to KO. And they're gonna deal 20 to her. Unless there's dragon resistance. She's not an ice dragon. Wait. Has there actually been an ice dragon? Or is Tiki an ice dragon? So far, I haven't seen an ice dragon. Hmm, I don't want to do this. I could warp Tiki here, but that's also kind of a bad idea. That's just a lot of attacks. And she can't one hit KO, dang it. I just, I just think I need to prep for the archers, so we're gonna stand here, Tiki, you get right here, we'll deal with it. Julian, go ahead and give Merrick his new heal staff. Let's move. I don't want the bars to go that way. Okay. I want... Merrick? Where's the end? Yes. You two. You go this way. Alright. Okay. Sheeta. So, she can tank... Archers now. However, that's still 22 damage. Mm. Even with Diode Shield, she's not helping. Oh, I don't know what to do. What is the best route to do this? I need to get rid of the Thief. Warp someone. Who do I warp? I could get Marth right here. You know what? That's that's okay. I can do that. We have like one more chapter and three more warps. I can use it.
This way we can stop the thief. I am not gonna lure him. I don't think that's a good idea. I'm gonna wait for the thief. Barstie, you're here. Same thing with Minerva. I kind of want them to avoid the dragons and deal with anyone else that might be heading this way. Alright, let's try it. Okay, I dodged. I'm like, what just happened? <laughs> Oh right, dragons have innate breath resistance, so it wasn't 40 damage. Okay, yeah, that's kind of why I set him there. Okay, let's see. Oh no, who are you healing? You're healing the dragon, aren't you? even notice that swarm okay okay good we dodged that works out okay. well I definitely got to get rid of some of these healers I did not realize I was that close well, luckily, we dodged. That works out. We're gonna need American Lid. Let's see. Marth, you can just stay there for now. Uh, Lind. You can't make it. Merrick. No, let's put you in the forest. With the lizard, we gotta deal some damage. Good, we dodged. And... We get a crit. Go jump! Good job, Merrick! Level 3. Skill, luck, weapon level. Alright. Okay. Let's go with the silver for 33 damage. What's my attack speed? Castor. The dragon killer. Except not really. But he heavily weakened it. Castor, you're doing very good. Very good, very good. Alright. Uh, let's go ahead and let... Your attack is 24. Yep, you got this. You got this. Hi, Molly. What? You want attention? You want attention? You're so needy. One second. Oh. I know what she wants. Give me a second.
Alright, I am back. I might as well get this guy. Since the hat's playing. Alright. Let's see. Get moving. Right, what is your range? Not good. I need to go. Okay. Alright, ad's done. You're uh, of course the dragon's fully healed. Alright, hold on. Seven. Sixteen. Not enough. I don't think that's enough. We should go with the silver. Okay. That worked out. That worked out. Now. Alright, Navarre, I'm going to have you go ahead and get rid of the other archer. Good. Now here's the thing, if someone dies, I, that's not an immediate reset, because I can revive them. I could just use all, unless it was Mark that dies, but that's a different story. So, I think you... Actually, I think there's an innate resistance by 10. You know what? Ice breath for 23, not enough. Not enough. Too bad there's no dancer. Yeah, there's no dancer here. That sucks. Eight damage. Wait, that, that was only eight damage? Huh. So does being a Mr. Dragon give you, like, 12 resistance or something to breath attacks? Navarre... Navarre's in danger. This is the first time I'm actually using Physic. Good thing I saved it all the way till now. Okay. And... I could play it safe. Yeah. We'll use at least. We'll have her heal. Perfect. No, play it safe. Play it safe. And Julian, just kind of hang out for now. First, uh, here, sure. How do I want to handle this? No matter what happens, someone's getting attacked by the archer. Or no, by the two dragons, actually. If I do this... 22, 10, 10 defense, so 12, not enough! This is bad. This is bad. We have Swarm and Recover. Swarm's a ranged one. Neither of them could survive. Two Dragon Breaths. Dang it. Uh, they... 
they need to go over here. They need to do this. Alright, is that it? Yep, alright, let's try it. good we dodged. It helps that we're on the mountains. And another dodge. Go Navar. Are dragons that scary when you can dodge like most of their attacks? Again, are there ice dragons? Like, actual ice dragons. Because so far, I have not seen one. The only one that has actually used an ice attack is Tiki. And she's a divine dragon. That's different. But yet, the game implies that there is one. Oh, uh, we're luring the dragons away. That's not bad. It's not a bad sign. Okay. Let's see. Marth, go ahead and get rid of the thief. Perfect. Double sword, which we don't need, but we have it anyway. So I'm gonna have Mark start focusing on the dragons. Wait a minute. Hold, hold on a second. How come this fire breath has a counter of 17 attacks, but this one doesn't? I'm confused. Ba Boom! Explosions, yeah, threw me off for a second there. I don't know how one particular dragon seems to have 17 uses of dragon's breath. But yeah, others don't. That confuses me. Strength skills. Boom! I need to get like a little animated like things for some of these sound effects. Make it a little bit more interesting. Money. Boom! And there we go. Navarre's doing good. Got rid of another dragon. Got a little bit of extra luck. That's good. Hey, Sydney, how's it going? I see you pop in here and there, but I just assume you're busy. What's been going on? Let's see, uh, I need to get rid of this guy. Varst! Come on. So right now, on book one, this is the second to the last chapter. But then, you know, we got book two. <laughs> Which is like a whole nother, like, full game. But I am doing fine right now. Skill, speed, weapon level, defense, HP. I mean, I had some someone call uh, come in, follow, say I'm boring, and then unfollow. But, you know, eh, it's, it is what it is. Uh, 27. Uh, 15, no, no, no. I think I'd rather just wait. Yeah, yeah, it is I can't be one of those uh, streamers that's just, like, constantly excited at everything and appeal to children. That's just not me. It, it would be fake. It, I can't do it. Besides, my current odds will probably leave. <laughs> Skill and luck. The stream's going fine other than that. People came in. Uh, we got some gift subs today. Uh... Yeah, I have the sub goal going. Hope if that fills up, that should let me get an order for 
want to try to get some sub badges going. Not a lot of sub badges, but maybe some sub badges. That's kind of the goal for that. Uh, Able? Need you to attack. Ideally, though, if we could get more subs, that'd be great. But so far, that's just kind of the minimum that I feel like, eh, that's, uh, that's probably best. Strength and luck. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, we can go right ahead. Uh... Okay, yeah. And... Oh, I thought he could double. Well, Kane's level 17. Oh, now he has the speed. Is that... Would that have been enough? No, it wouldn't. I have no clue. I have no clue right now. I'm not worried about it right now. I'll worry about it once that, uh, I guess when the sub bowl actually gets filled. But I'm gonna have to think about it. Uh, I guess I need to get rid of them. I know. I know. Any luck on commission hunting, Sydney? Have you found any luck? Seven skill and luck. All right, Castor is really just doing super well. Give, uh, gift you the animated emotes, but that's that. I, I can't give emotes that cost money, but that's what the soap goal is for. No luck, but you're fine. Uh, that's too bad. Can I cross the mountains? Oh, we can't. Alright. But yeah, uh... Yeah, we got the re animated emote. I do like it. There is an alternate form of it that actually says rigged when the coffee gets on the screen. But, uh, I haven't... I'm not 100% sure which one I like better, so right now I'm just sticking with the one that doesn't have it. Maybe I'll swap it over and see if I like it more. We'll see. Alright. Let's see. I don't know- I don't understand why this dragon has 17 uses of its own fire breath. But this one is perfectly fine. You can use it as much as it wants. All right, Marth, time for you to slay a dragon. Okay, I need Marth right here. We're gonna have a Falchi on equipped, ready to go. Let's see. I do like these emotes, they look very nice. I thought about going with more emotes instead, but I do think that maybe the first thing I should try to get next is the sub badges. Stream going uh, kind of okay here and there. All right, time to attack dragons. Wait, hold on. I think I want Navar to go after this one. That way, he's still in the mountain. I know, like, I, I checked my- the amount I can have. I can have a total of eight at the moment. But, like, I don't think I'll be able to get all eight to start with, but we'll see. I'll figure it out later. I double ch uh, I don't know. Uh, I think... Again, I'm kind of not really thinking about it too much at the moment. Uh, does someone need healing? Oh, Caster could use healing.
But yeah, uh, I'll worry about it later once uh, I get a better idea. But yeah, that's kind of what the sub goal is for. No, it's more about like I worry about like, worry about ordering the emotes when I have a better idea of what I can do later. That's kind of more what I'm thinking. Can't really plan out too much when I don't know how much I can get. If that makes sense. Can I get rid of that dragon bomb? Twenty-seven. Fifteen. Oh no. Agma needed literally one more point in attack. Oh, wait. I just realized Bars can probably lose. Yeah, you need to back out. Is Agma in range of two? Yes. Okay. We're gonna heal Bars like this. Then I'm gonna physic for Agma. Oh, wait, I have Minerva and Sheeta. Oh, I didn't think about that. Okay, wait a minute. If Sheeta goes to attack, attack of 22. Oh, wait, she has 20. Mm, dang. Okay, Minerva, what about you? Do some work. Well, I'll let you go ahead and do that, Sydney. Have a good day. Uh, you know what? I think we can make this work. Agma, you go ahead and do this. I really should have given Agma the one of the worm slayers. That would have helped. He can double. I forgot he could do that. Strength, weapon, resistance, and HP. Sadly, resistance doesn't work. Not with Dragon's Breath. I need Agama to have more than 20. Which. Lena has enough strength to heal 24. So that works out. Oh, think about it. I don't want to get too close anyway. Dang it. Although, since we're kind of close to using up the dragons, we can do this. Who's left? Do your thing and dodge. There's a good chance. Perfect. Okay. And Swarm is attacking Minerva. Dodge that. Okay, who are you attacking? You're attacking Ogma. That's fine. He dodged anyway. Good job, Agma. Alright. Marv, let's see. Oh. I don't want to get in range with the other one just yet. Wait, hold on. Marv, if you were to attack right now, 43 damage. Yeah, I don't want to attack right this second. I don't want to get enraged with the second dragon. So we're gonna do that. Let's see. Over here. Let's start with Actually, how many how many more turns does Tiki have? 
I can have Tiki go over here. Start going after this one. Probably have to transform Tiki again, but that's fine. She has plenty of uses to transform. Uh, Var, go ahead and grab your KO. And that's the last of that Worm Slayer. You know what? I'm gonna buy another Worm Slayer. Yeah, I'm gonna have Julian buy another one. to go around. You can't cross the mountains. Can Len across the mountains? Yes, she can. And you're just kind of here, Zane. Alright. Agma, you're not going to be that helpful. Oh, wait, there's a heal. What can you do? Physic? Okay. Yeah, we need to go stop that. Who's left? I want Sheeta to go ahead and get rid of the guy with Swarm. I think everyone else is a healer. Yes. So let's go ahead and get rid of this guy first. 22, minus 5, 17. That would be enough. Javelin, is that enough? Two hits? No, just a single one. Sure, we'll attack with the Javelin. Haven't really used much of those. And we get a crit. That works out. Thanks, Kane. And we got Fortify, which... I could go in storage. Cast storage, you follow. Let's see. I think we need to plug these forts. Or at least some of them. And I think that's what Minerva's gonna start doing. I'll have Sheeta and Minerva plug these two forts. I may have... And then I'll have Kane and Abel and Caster around here, because I don't know what's gonna spawn. Left. All right, duh, I have American Lena. Or Lind. Jeez, I always get their names confused. Okay, Tiki, you got this. You're probably gonna have to physic her. Good. Of course, the dragons go in the mountains, but that's fine. And that is why I held off. On attack. Yeah, okay, who are you healing? Makes sense. How much HP do you have? You have 22. You can survive another hit. You're out of range. Time to use the foul shield. Luckily, you should be fast enough to double. And we dodged? There we go. Too bad he's already at max EXP. If I'm correct, if this was the DS version, 
Marth can get to level 30. Okay, so Marth should... You know what, maybe he should go back on the floor for a little bit. Silver? No, we don't need to waste that. Okay, well, we'll get him next turn. Where's Julia? There you are. I want to buy another Worm Slayer. Probably gonna need next chapter. I think that'll be fine. I think that's all I need. Alright. Tiki! You need healing. Bars here. Healing and Physic heal for the same amount. So I'm gonna go right ahead and use Physic. out. I'm gonna go ahead and have Tiki go right here. Stand on the fort and attack from a distance. Take over the enemy castle, Tiki! You are a true Durgan when you do that. Alright, and Navarre is just kinda here. I don't think he really needs to do much more. Let's see. I'm gonna feed Abel this one. Actually, the iron should be enough, right? And eh, we'll use the steel. Oh, never mind. Alright, let's go into Kane then. Again, by the before I end this chapter, Kane and Abel should promote. I'm just trying to get them whatever EXP I can. Oh, you know what? Uh you need to head back up here. Master can currently stand on the fort. American Lind, get close, in this case. You know what, I don't want to waste Starlight just in case, so we're gonna do that. He's left. If we want her to actually do something, she needs to actually move. I just realized Julian needs to be on the move. That way he could go open the treasure chest. I should have been doing that. Level 9, strength, skill, speed, luck, and HP. Spend some time healing. Magma, you go ahead and finish this guy off. Ads playing. Okay. I'll take care of some of the other stuff. Minerva, block this fort.
second. If there is reinforcements, they're gonna spawn there. Let's see. Who's left? Julian. I think he could cross through mountains. We need to start moving, I guess. Sheeta, you go here. We're gonna have you trade. Silver and VIP card. We go ahead and transform into Sheeta because why not? Probably just put you somewhere safe. Make sure you have no chance of getting attacked. Stand there yet. You only have fire breath. Okay. Well, Tiki can go ahead and start working on this dragon. She can tank. The best way to attack dragons is with more dragons. At least not that I'm aware. There we go. Tiki's done. At least on that end. Okay. Level 10. Strength, skill, speed, luck, and HP. Honestly, it's stuff like speed and luck that's better than her attack. Mars good. We need Marth right here. Okay. Tiki, what are we looking at when we attack? That is not a fire dragon, so we're looking at 26 with at least a resistant 20. So not much. Tiki's done. Tiki's done. Go ahead and heal. Tiki's done her job. She's done very well. Okay. Navar, I think I think we'll send Navar in. He should be fine. And just in case, we'll send Bars as backup. Agma 2. Alright. Over here, uh, we'll make sure that everyone's blocking. Who's left? Okay, Julian, you need to start crossing. Zane, just hang out here, I guess. I just wanted you to have more movement. Sheeta. Alright, this is very important. You need to head to the secret shop. Because there's obviously something here. I have some reinforcements. Okay. It really matters. Will you dodge, Mark? Yes. That's good. That's a good start. However, I don't want to get attacked by this guy just yet. So we are going back on the fort. Cheetah, you need to head over here. Julian. Oh, this is gonna be slow. I should have started crossing that sooner. Alright, an attack of 50 with a defense of 15. 
This guy will not survive. Come on, Navar, you got this. This world and everything on it is ours. The ones who intrude were you humans. We'll see about that. And like a champ, he dodges. And... Oh, Navar missed. Interesting. Honestly, Navar has it covered. He's got it covered. Alright, who's left? Uh I guess we'll just have her keep moving. Remember, if someone dies, I could just revive him right now. Oh no, he's got a little bit of health left back. Ah, there we go. There's reinforcements. I just didn't know when. Well, took out the dragon. Lord Medeus, please forgive me. Okay, I'm out of Worm Slayers. At least at the moment. Okay, good, Mark dodged. This was not a part of the plan. I should have sealed those up. Okay. Uh, how do I want to handle this? Yeah. He's using a broken sword at the moment. Okay, I was not prepared for more dragons. I should have been prepared for more dragons. But for some reason, I wasn't. Okay. At least they waste a turn uh, transforming. So that gives... Lena and Merrick a chance to go ahead and use the lizard safely. Good. Three, strength, skill, speed, luck, and HP. Is there a chance we could go ahead and use like a steel? Attack of 25, defense of 12. Yes. Go Abel. He didn't even need the crit. That worked out. You can stay right there. I'll let you stay there for now. This is tricky. Now, I think this guy is just gonna hang here. I don't think he's gonna move. So that's not a bad thing. Oh, how do I wanna handle this? First, Tiki, you need to transform again. I could repair the 
the uh, Worm Slayer. I could do that. Okay, that's an idea. Skill and luck, okay. That is a strategy. Okay. Oh, uh, this might be bad. Alright. Let's see what the shop is. It's a secret. What do we find? Oh. I don't think I need this shop, but it reminds me of all the ones I do have already that I can use up. That's, uh, that could be a useful one. I don't even know. I need to go. I should go through my stuff. Alright. Navar, you need to dodge at least one. Good. You live. Think about that. Oh, you're fine. And good. Navarre dodged the second one. Perfect. Damn. Navarre's just that strong. He's moving. Interesting. Wait, are there no reinforcements now? Is that the only set? Is that going to be the only set of reinforcements? Huh. Usually there'd probably be another one. Okay, hold on. Um, how do I want to handle this? You need to move. You need to move. You know what? I think we'll let... I think we'll let Tiki handle this for a second. Tiki, you go right ahead and attack this one. I want to block the path. Okay. Their path is blocked. We are actually going to use Hammond. We're gonna repair the Worm Slayer. This was an achievement I had to use, repair a weapon. I was gonna use it for Aura, but apparently it disappears. You know what, I think I'm gonna have Bars go ahead and use the Hand Axe. Try to get some extra damage on this guy. He was successful. That helps. How much HP do you have? 21? Okay. That works out. I'm, I'm kind of thinking I might warp Julian, or would that be a waste? We have three more uses. We have three uses of warp left. I'm wondering if I should use it to speed it up, or just save the three for the final chapter. Let's out. Go, Marth. Okay, I didn't think about that. Go, Barst. You dodged. Deal some extra damage. Nothing. That's nothing. Perfect. Yeah, he couldn't attack. That's good. Alright, Marth, I guess you can head back. Julian. Yeah, you start moving. What is your range? Mm, this ain't? I don't think that's enough. But we have Navarre to put the Worm Slayer. How do I want to handle this? Do 
What if I do this and attack for 26 damage? Get rid of the hero. Uh, never mind. She gets the 4% chance to miss. Are you kidding me? That's ridiculous. Alright, um... He is not going to attack from range. Or, he's not going to attack Navar up close. I know that. So I am going ahead and heal. I'm going to heal Agma. And the dragon is going to move first. And because the dragon is going to move first, we'll probably attack Navar. I want Ogma to go ahead and uh, we are going to have something like. There we go. That's what I want. So far, they're not doing anything. You stay there. Julian's already moved. Is it really only one set of reinforcements? That's a little ridiculous. Normally, we see a bunch more. This is why I did the swapping around. Nine. Yeah, there doesn't seem to be any more reinforcements. Alright. Uh, Tiki, go ahead and stand here. Oh wait, no, no, that's not the right one. I need Tiki to stand here. Start plugging in these spots just in case. First, I need you. Start doing that. Lena, go ahead and trade the heal staff. Do that. All right, and Julian, you'll get there. At least you have seven movement. You'll catch up. I think. I think we're done. I don't see any more reinforcements coming. Yeah, I think it was just the one set. It's strange. When reinforcements show up, it's usually multiple waves. we use the secret shop. I don't think I need the extra stats. Besides, I already have a decent amount of stat boosts in storage anyway. And there's no one I could think of that I could, like, really boost, except for, like, Sheeta or Minerva. But honestly, at this point, they're just kind of here. We're done. Knight's Crest. If I want the achievement, I need to do this now. And we got the power in. Granted, I think we're going to be indoors next chapter. So, 
Actually, being a paladin doesn't matter. Okay. That works out. Is that it? That's it. chest. We get another Firestone. If you're using Bantu, we'll seize the castle. I don't think there's anything else I need to do. <laughs> Foolish kid. Don't think you're so great. Even though you've entered my castle, I won't surrender to the likes of you. Right now, I sh I'll show you the true might of us Earth Dragons. Come to me. I'll send you to the pits of hell. And we're gonna save, and I'm gonna have to call it there. Thanks for everyone who showed up. I'm doing these streams Monday through Friday at noon Pacific time. If you want to see the old streams that are not on Twitch anymore, they're on YouTube at scottbot 64 stream archives. There's a link in the about page. Next time, finishing book one, probably start book two. I should be streaming tomorrow. I There may be a chance I may be skipping or I may be late, but so far it seems like I will be streaming tomorrow. If I don't stream tomorrow, then I'll see you Monday. Have a good day. Later.